Say what's up, John fam. Back at you, man. By the way, happy Thanksgiving to you. Hope everybody enjoy themselves, their families and whatnot, man. And be safe out there. Right now, I'm going to show you how to inject this turkey. I'm going to smoke this one. I keep this plastic ring in it just to keep these legs together. Let me show you what I do first. Say, but I'm going to show you these seasons, huh? I got that roasted garlic. Got that good onion powder. I got a Montreal chicken seasoning. Of course, garlic powder, always. Oregano, always got to have it. Good black pepper. French is mustard. The injector I got today for the turkey I'm doing gonna be the butter injectable. But I've mixed other stuff in here that's different. It's my own blend. I got chicken I gotta do also, which I'm gonna inject that chicken with this. Right here. See how that turned out with the same marinade. So what you do first, you're gonna get your injector, which comes in a pack. Look like this here. Comes with needle and everything. Get your little injector. Put them off in there like this here. Then just pull back on. Right? That's how you doing. What you trying to do, you gonna start off with just breast first, right? Get them off in a the point. Just like that. But drag it out as you shoot it. Right? Hit you another point. Get deep off in there. Drag him as you shoot him. Hit you another point. Now with this turkey, I'm going to dry it off before I season it. Because you don't want water off in there. You want the seasoning to stick. Truthfully, I'm going to have this turkey on the pit maybe four hours. Maybe five, truthfully, because I'm going to have it on there for about an hour and a half with no fall on it. Then I'm going to wrap him in fall and let it do its thing and just let it get done. You know, after I do this, I'm gonna rub it with butter just to moisturize your, your turkey. Get off in there. Look how you see how I swell up. You know, you're getting them in there. Juice is gonna run out, don't worry about that. It's going to be straight regardless, I promise you that. Now, this is a honeysuckle turkey. Not a butter ball like most people get. I don't pull them out. You're going to get off in there. I don't pull them out. Get off in there. Right? We're going to go breast again. Cause that be the driest part on the turkey. Make sure you keep them right. Keep them moist. Going back in there again. Right. We'll hit the breast one more time. Uh, right there. Come up by them. 
Hit the breast. Come up out of it. Let's see. Go right there. Come up out of it. It's simple to inject the turkey, man. It's not hard whatsoever. A lot of people make this hard and it's really not. They make it harder than what it seems. It ain't that hard. Now, of course, I do use my own special herbs and things like that with this, which will be in the description below. And if you haven't did it, please do it. Go subscribe, like, and share. Trying to get to 100 subscribers right now. And I will be doing a catering event. We're going to pick subscribers. And I got y'all, I promise you, I'm going to show y'all some love. That's the breastplate right there, right? You still want to put it in there, though. That's the breastplate. You still want to get in there. What you do, make sure you wash your hands. Again, I'm always tell you that, wash your hands, wash your hands, wash your hands. Turkey. Flip this boy over. Boy got a little weight to him. We'll go injectable again. Go on knock his backside out real quick. Cause I gotta get my fire going and let everything sit on there. This would be like a turkey thigh, basically. Get that bar right. Turkey wing. Hit both parts. The wing part and the drum part. This that back. Like I say, some gonna leak out. Ain't too much you can do about that. What I am gonna do with this turkey though, I'm gonna cut an onion up and put on the inside with a little rosemary while it's smoking on the grill to enhance that flavor. Just fill around for it. Might not go in when you first do it, but just fill around. I promise it will. This ain't hard at all. Simple, easy. I promise you. We gonna get him in there. I'm going to say, I'm going to pat this boy down when I finish. Make sure I pat him down. Before I put that seasoning on there, because I want everything to stick to it. I'm going to do a wet marinade on this turkey. And all you do, just go over it again. See, like that's a bone I'm hitting. You want to get in between that bone. Well, 
I'm gonna go there. Get off of there. Every part of the turkey need to have that injection in it. Oh, I got turkey drumsticks, smoked turkey drumsticks in here, smoked turkey necks in here. This is going to be for my cabbage. I'm doing cornbread dressing. I'm doing macaroni. You get the Velveeta, but you got to add your little twist to it, which I'm going to show y'all how to do that also. It's not a problem, nothing hard. Very easy. Very easy. Gotcha, man. Y'all gonna get tired of me. We cooking today. We got a lot to cook. We already got the pies done. Main thing is me just getting this grilling out the way. That's the main thing. Once I do that, we'll be all right. Flip it one more time, put him back on his back. I bought these pans at Kroger's. Buy two, get one free. I'm always trying to give y'all some kind of deal. Easy work, easy work. Easy work. Just wherever you think you need some more in, shoot it. Right? That boy good to go. We're gonna go season this now. Start off with garlic powder. Everybody watching my channel know I love garlic pot. People say, I thought you'd never stop pouring, huh? Matter of fact, I actually need to go and get a bit of a deeper pan in there. Don't work that out. Watch this boy out real quick. Get this and take it out of there, put it in a whole nother pan a deeper pan that I can really work with.
גדול כבר. Like I said, I got some ribs, I got some chicken I gotta do. I got a hell of a lot to cook today, honestly. Our troops should have did this last night, but I like to have my turkey fresh. Which means we might eat by uh, 8 o'clock at the latest. Once I do this here, this onion pop. Right, spread the more wings out. Which I'm gonna rub them down anyway. Regardless. We're gonna take some of this roasted garlic and herb. Check them out. And mess with this turkey real quick. Play like that, we gonna go on get him right, huh? Let's go on get him right. Go on get this boy right, mate. Huh? Ain't no plane. That's what we doing. Then we going black pepper. Now notice, I am gonna put brown sugar and mustard on this, so all this gonna seep in. Within that rub, and I'm smoking it, so it's gonna get everything I'm putting on here. Again, I'm gonna put an onion in the inside, rosemary, and a little garlic to make this thing do what it's supposed to do. Oh, we're going to oregano. Fall in the bottom of the pan, which you honestly want that anyway. I ain't drying him off because he looked pretty dry to me. He was okay, so I, it wasn't no need to dry it off. We're going brown sugar with this. Look like a lot, but it's really not. Right. Then we're going mustard. Everything in the bottom of that pan is going to be on this turkey. Look like a lot of mustard, but it ain't. Get off in there. See what you're doing? Trying to mix it up. Everything. Don't get them right. Get the cavity of it. Lay it together right there, but you still can get off in the grooves of it with no problem. So you get all this seasoning you got.
uh, play with it. For those that don't know, a turkey comes with a little red dot on it. It pops out when it's ready. For people that didn't understand what that dot was there for, I'm telling you what it's for right now. It's going to pop out when it's ready. I always remember that. So don't pull the dot out. I know a lot of people might get it and say, hey, I'm getting rid of this. Don't. See, we're going to take him. Come on. Hey, boy. What's the deal? Say, man, I got my brother in the house, huh? Oh, man. What's going on? You know what I'm talking about? My bro fresh out work. Rubbing his body iron, a good turkey. No doubt, no doubt, no doubt was in the pot. Yeah. Say, man, look, bro come in here. I got smoked turkey necks, smoked turkey legs and that. That's for that cabbage. Huh? Okay. Boy doing something different. Okay, okay. I'm telling y'all, subscribe to me. I'm telling y'all, subscribe to me. I'm showing y'all new moves out here. Look at me, look how I'm rubbing this boy. Mm. Boy, this is gonna be a beast. That boy injected too? Come on, man. Get off the game. You gonna stuff it? Hey, I'm putting onions, road mirrors inside of it. I'm gonna smoke him to death. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, smoke him to death. I got three heads of cabbage in here. Say, man. We're gonna eat around this camp. What you gonna do with the ribs? Oh, we're gonna put that on that too. Oh, we got real. Oh, it's a bunch of chicken too. I'm doing all that. Yeah. And homemade dress. I got a ham I gotta put on the pit too. I forgot about that. You gonna smoke a ham? Yeah. Gotta smoke that. Brown sugar glaze on it. Pineapple. Cherry, uh, what that is, that fruit cup. Mm. Yeah, that's what we doing. No digging, no doubt. Shit, we gonna hook this ball up, man. It's yeah. Thanksgiving power hour. Say, man, we doing <laughs> something, baby. Say, man, check this turkey out, though. Man, this ball look ferocious. Ooh, this ball look ferocious. Hmm. Look at it. Mm -hmm. I want to take a bite out of him right now. Yeah, it must look good. I ain't lying, man. What all you put on it, man? Say. We got some garlic pop. We got Montreal garlic and herb. Mm -hmm. We got basil. We got oregano, black pepper, onion pop, accent. Man, we working today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No diggity, no doubt. Man, we gonna have the butt right. We here. No game. Take him. Look at, oh, flipping back. Boy, looking light on that color. I done rubbed him down. Rub him one more time. There we go. Mm. Rub him one more time. Don't be scared of him. Get your hand dirty. Get off in there. Get right. I left that plastic ring on for a reason. I keep telling y'all. Hold them old legs together. Again, the dot I was talking about is right here. When it pops out, the turkey ready. I leave mine on a little bit longer. That's just me making sure it's right. Look at him. That boy look ball fool. Look at him. Look at him. Come on. Boy look good enough to eat right now. <laughs> huh? Boy, you know bird right, right there. Yeah. Too, big boy, ain't That's big boy right there. They call him a young bird. That's what they said. Ain't no young about that old motherfucker. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> boy, gonna be right, man. Say, I'm gonna be back to y'all, man, with this boy on the grill. Please subscribe, like, share. Show you boss some love. Like I say, first 100 subscribers, we're gonna pick one. I'm definitely going to cater something for you. You actually call what I cater, and I'm going to cook it.
no problem. Next time you see me, it's gonna be on the grill. Appreciate all the love. Appreciate all the support. We gonna keep pushing, man. It's a movement. Let's do it how it's supposed to go.